group is that in relation to last season's team? I think we're at a great point right now with the way we're playing on both sides of the ball. We can't complain really when we're number one in defensive efficiency and offensive efficiency. At this point, it's just about getting better and building great habits for the playoffs. Excellent. No problem. Which is the big challenge that you think you guys face when getting together? Big challenge? Yeah. Not being complacent, challenging yourself every night, and never taking any opponent lightly, no matter if it's a play, the number one seed in the East or the 16th seed in the West. You gotta treat every opponent like they're a threat to beat you. If we do that, we'll build great habits and be prepared to win or compete for a championship. There is something that maybe you bring with you after the way that the last season ended? In terms of maybe try to get in bed or try to correct? Or yeah, just it's just about getting to the finish line and not letting up as cliche as that sounds and um, just going game by game. I think we did a great job at last season. I think we had an amazing season. We all seem to get over the hump and win a championship, but we learned a lot about each other and we developed some uh, we developed some great relationships and had some great times. So, uh, so like you said, to get to the finish line and to do it year after year, is there something that the teams that do it are different than the teams that fail to do that? Players or just as a team, qualities that they possess more of? Oh, no, I don't think so, because I think we, we got there in 2015 and we did it. And we got there in 2016 and we didn't. I mean. There's been a lot of teams in the past who have, not, have lost it in the championship series and won the championship series. We're not going to let it define a legacy. We still have so much basketball left and so many more games to win. And but I'm referring more to just from October to June yeah, yeah. to oh. do it for a whole season, regardless of the outcome in the final. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a testament to how good that team, how great of a team they are, how much they play together. You know, you're not going to win this in this league individually. Uh, every great player we won this league had a great team around him. You could go all the way back to Bill Russell and Bob Cousy. And um, I think it's a testament just to the professionalism of each team who does that and uh, the talent. I mean, you saw with the Miami Heat going four years in a row to the finals. It's, Pretty spectacular. Yeah. Please, just on a side note, obviously, um, you may be biased for this answer. You know, you're you're a bulldog owner in terms of a dog owner. And like, I was talking to my girl, she was we're contemplating like a German Shepherd or a bulldog. You know, you, you, your answer may be. <laughs>